Multiverse team. Let's go. You know we souls, man. We don't die. We only crystallize. We ascend to the next life. You know? Me, for example. I just became, like, an older soul person. You feel me? Like, every old soul person used to be a new soul when they self-created themselves into existence spiritually. You feel me? So let me break this down for y'all. You know, soulful life forms. The reason why we always ascend to the next life because we are the guardians of the angel number multiverses. You feel me? That's real deep Jules Metamorphous talk for the mind, heart, and soul. Y'all all seeing mind, heart, and soul. I have intuition can pick that up and grasp that and download into your cybernetic DNA. You know, I'm a guardian of the angel number multiverses. And a lot of my soul family of all alien species are guardians of the angel number multiverses. So, you think about this physical body, you feel me? When we ascend to the next life, man. You feel me? We is the physical. We is the lyrical. We is the metaphysical. We all of that. We all of the divine essence in the angel number multiverses. The only ones who do die are the demon room alien slave owners. Because the demon room alien slave owners, they come from a matrix realm, an empty vibrational solar realm. So, the way they try to feed off of life to stay alive is to drain energy of the masses of the angel number multiverses. So when they can't put a lot of masses in fear, the demon remaining slave owners, they die out. Us soulful beings, you know, we don't die, we only crystallize, you feel me? Oh, and by the way, this is Lakey Inspired Blossom Instrumental too. Because us soulful life forms, we always blossom. We're like cherry blossoms in the blue skies of the Cosmo Angel Number Multiverse is always making it work. You feel me? We souls don't die. We only crystallize. We ascend to the next life. We're like cyber elves. Because soulful beings, our presence, our soulful divine presence is always here. Protecting the angel of a multiverse no matter what century it is, no matter what timeline it is. All the alternate timelines, all the angel of multiverses is always going to be healed. Always going to be protected by all the soulful ET life forms from the anthropomorphics, extraterrestrials, celestials, reploids, all the soulful alien life forms, including me from planet Ice World of Universe 21. Around the planets of Shemespio and Izodio. You feel me? Let's go, man. We souls, we only rise. We only ascend to the next life. We don't die. All verse rise in my soul family. So we souls, we don't die. We only crystallize. You know? Every single soulful life form that's an old soul individual used to be a new soul individual. I used to be a new soul individual when I self-created myself into existence spiritually through the all-seeing mind, heart, and soul eye, you know? Because our mind, heart, and soul eye is an intuitional brain that can see a lot of things and can create a lot of things through lucid dream magic. But, um, you know, so we soulful beings, we only ascend to the next life we crystallize we don't die because we are guardians of the angel number multiverses from all types of et extraterrestrials anthropomorphic celestials robotic species any type of alien life form in the angel number multiverse cosmos we are guardians of the angel number multiverses so we souls we don't die we only crystallize you know and as we souls always be rising up each atom second of the day, each day and night, we can just keep the angel known multiverse protected because these demon room alien slave owners, those narcissistic sociopaths, psychopaths, soulless demon room alien slave owners, they are the ones who die because the way they, the way the demon room alien slave owners got to keep themselves alive, they have to keep the masses being in fear base, being in fear based agenda. So when they can't keep the masses in fear base. You know, 
the demon remain with slave owners, they die out and they do all this fear-based agendas because the demon remain with slave owners know that their time is up in the 21st century and all the timelines, you know, and all the multiverses, man, I'm telling you, we lit out here. We soulful beings. Anytime we transition to the next life with a new lifetime, we become cyber elves. You know, we are the living ancestors. You know, we're living legends. We're eternal legends. We never die. We only ascend to the next life. You feel me? So some soulful life forms, you know, they live it in their 100th lifetime order, a millionth lifetime. And I'm going to tell you this, each single soulful life form, since we don't die, we only crystallize. It's the reason why we have so many multiverses in existence is always coming into existence. You know, every single soulful alien life form has created a planet, has created a universe. Just like me, I, I created planet Ice World, Isodio Shemespio, you know, because us soulful life forms, since we are master ascenders, we just special like that to create soulful planets and universes. We don't, we don't die. We're healers of our ancient number multiverses. You feel me? That's all we do. That's all we do. And um, we just gonna take our sweet little time explaining this because, like, I really like for you all to understand, understand, and overstand within your mind, heart, and soul eye that. We soulful ET beings, we never gonna, we never gonna die. Because that's a fear-based program that the Deerum alien slave owners try to implant into the masses. Because our angel number multiverses is always gonna be alive because we soulful beings are always alive and thrive.